kill him, Brass. Look at oh, his teeth. His teeth. He's, he's gonna shit himself. Oh, fucking hell, that was lucky. 8% health left. He did well there, I would have died. Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of Button Bashers, where we're doing, starting something a bit different to the norm that we've done before. Is it, is it different? Well, it, it is because it's a new we are... Series a new series or whatever. A series, yeah. It, yeah. So we are starting to play some games on the Evercade, which we've wanted to do for ages. Yeah. We've been waiting for the Evercade Versus to come out so we could start to do some of the collections. We thought we'd do episode, each episode sort of dedicated to a different collection and just kind of see what we think of each one. Yeah, and I think the, the plan will be that we'll rate them in some way, or well, like have a sort of leaderboard, we're gonna, I guess. Yeah, we're gonna rate them for, like I don't think you're coming here to get our review scores. No, exactly. But we are gonna rate them for us where they place in comparison yeah. to each other, which I don't know what we're gonna do when we disagree, yeah. but we'll figure that one out when it happens. Oh, yeah, I didn't even think about that. You're guaranteed with any collections of games, there's going to be some absolute duds, right? Yeah. There's going to oh, be yeah. some terrible yeah. things on there. But we're hoping. I mean, we're big fans of Evercade in general, right? Yeah, I've got we, every. Cart I think we've both got every cartridge. Pretty much, yeah. yeah. We've both got the handhelds. Both got the Founder edition. Of the verses. Of the yeah. verses. Yeah. Big and fans. We, just, we just love retro games, right? Yeah. And that's the whole point in yeah. why we do this. So. For anyone who doesn't know what the Evercade is. Oh, yeah. we'll, we'll, we'll touch on this super quick because most people who are watching this video probably do. Evercade is a, started out as a handheld console. They released the Evercade Versus, which is what we're playing on today, the, the home version of the Evercade. They take the same cartridges and each cartridge, as we have here, we have the Interplay 1 cartridge, which we're doing today, is dedicated to a different studio or a different kind of game. Some are like Indie Hero sets as well, which are different. Yeah, I think creators. outside of those indie ones, they tend they are, to be from uh, one from creator, a, one, yeah, yeah, one publisher, or yeah. one um, one developer, developer, one publisher. Whatever, yeah. yeah. So each one comes with a cartridge, an instruction manual, which is actually quite nice to see. They're again. really cool. Like, yeah, in, yeah they, they've they've tackled the feeling of sort of the nostalgia feeling of collecting, of collecting games. Yeah, you know, what the cleverest thing they did was put a number on the side. Yeah. There's a number on the top, so you have to have them all because it'd be really annoying if you were missing mm -hmm. one in the order. So. Shall we? Let's get we, we, did, we did a random draw oh, about yeah. what cartridge we were going to play. Brass literally held them up like this, and I went and, and picked one out without being able to see the spines. And, and we will. And we will do. We're going to go. We'll go them, through right? all of them. Yeah. yeah. So it's not like we're going to miss any out. I but. think we probably, as new ones come, we will probably try to do ones when they're brand new, yeah, and in between that, do older ones. But yeah. we're going with one of the first ones, which I think number if you four. buy, yeah, number four, which is Interplay Collection One. I think if you buy the handheld in its kind of like collector edition version. I think this is one of the carts that comes with it. I think right. it comes with three carts and this is one of them. Yep. It's only got six games on it, so it's not one of the most jam-packed cartridges. But okay. shall we jump in and see what we've got? Yeah. Cool, right, okay. So where we start, we start with Battle Chess. Well, yeah, should we run we'll through, through, what, through what they are? Yeah, we you have go for it. Battle Chess. Which I've no idea what it is. I don't know if I've ever played it. I, I, I'm pretty chess? sure it's chess, but when they move around, you see like fighting. Oh, uh, right, okay. Things. So the old Star Wars. What was the thing from Star Wars where they played on the chess? Yeah, the, that kind of thing where he plays Chewy against Chewy. Yeah. Chess, yeah. yeah. Then we've, we've got Booger Mount, yeah. which I remember quite well. Yep. Clay Fighter. Which okay. I remember being quite bad. Right. I'd imagine it hasn't aged yeah. well simply because it was at, around that time, wasn't it, where everything was using pre rendered sprites. Probably the outstanding game of the cartridge. I mean, I'd buy the cartridge just for this game. But yeah, really. I think that's. I think it's one of the main reasons I wanted to get it. Earthworm Jim, Earthworm Jim. like a complete classic. It's like my. Yeah, we'll come to it when, it, yeah. when we get it. Incantation. I've never now, heard of that. No, I, I saw a screenshot of it on the back. I saw a screenshot of it on the back or on the instruction manual, and that kind of gave me a bit of a triggered a bit of a memory for me. But I don't think I ever played it. I and mean, Titan. I don't have a clue what Titan okay. is. Is it Titan? The Titan. font's really bad. Yeah, he's underneath but I can Titan. See all the Titan. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Should yeah. we start from the top? <laughs> yes. go, let's, let's go have in a, game a rip roaring battle. battle chess, just yeah. so people know, we're not gonna. We're only gonna touch on each of these games. Yeah, play a little no bit of each. Ball. We're not playing through loads of them. But just gonna give you a bit of a feel, right? Battle chess, brass. Let's do it. It better be two player. I'm sure. It will I'm sure it is. It says it's two player. We bring back memories of my time in sixth form college where I spent most of it playing chess. I've played very tea. little chess in my life, so I think I might be about to well, get bad at yeah, chess. Well, no, I can't remember how to play it now. All right. Oh, shit, straight into it. Oh, wait, Are no. you? I don't know. I don't, do you not know if you're playing? Well, let's see if, if I... Oh. Oh, God. That's so slow. <laughs> That's so slow. Oh, God, we'll be here all afternoon. <laughs> Checkmate me, ASAP. Did, during the creation of this, did no one go, 
Is that too slow? No, because remember back then you'd like you want to get the most out of a out of a game, and the longer it takes, it's that, it's that it's that perfect amount. Kill him! It's not quite annoying. Kill him! You can't do that. You have to move die. No. Right. Is that right? Yeah, it is. Right. I'm gonna send this pawn into die because I want to see what it looks like when someone. Yeah, we want to see some of them. I want to see some of those sweet, right. sweet action moves. Right, kill him, brass. We need someone a voiceover. You know that uh, SpongeBob. Ten hours later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Approximately ten hours later. Oh shit! <laughs> oh, you, you stubbed his toe. Oh. Oh. Straight in the eye. I sent the queen to batter him. I want to know what happened. Little wiggly bum. Yeah, look at that. The cheeks are quite <laughs> defined. <laughs> they definitely have gone into town with the pixels. Oh shit! What's the queen gonna do? Aerobics. <laughs> oh, ma she got magic. Did he just shard? <laughs> why did oh, you, why why did you just put your that? queen where I can take your queen? Because I can take you, right? Pawn can move backwards, right? No. Yes? Right? No? No. No, I don't oh. think so. Because we're not gonna, we don't want to be here all day, that's why. Well, I'm killing your queen then. Get that's her! It. Get her! Bitch fight! <laughs> oh no, but fuck, your knight can take my queen. Yeah. We suck at chess. Yeah. I did not expect the king to pull out his Beretta. Yeah. I don't know how much longer I can go on this for us. <laughs> I, I'll be honest, I'm quite enjoying this. <laughs> I don't think I play this on my own, but as a two-player game. I don't think it's great for a video. It's too slow, right? It's too slow. Have we had enough battle chess? Well, yeah, I think so. I think we'll have to declare this. We'll declare this in a win to you, Brass. Okay. You've, you've won this one. Yeah. Boogerman. Okay. Boogerman. Now do this you, one. Do you want to play Boogerman? Yeah. Go on. Well, we'll let you play it, and then I'll laugh at you, and I'll have a go and be better. This so, is 1995. Yeah, I remember renting this. I remember renting this. Yeah. I, it's definitely not a game to buy. But, you know, how many games that came out at the time would allow you to fart and pick your nose? And yeah, throw it. snot at people. Booger man. I remember this. I remember I rented, playing this, like, yeah. once. In yeah. fact, I think my friend rented it, and I had a go on it at his. It, it definitely wasn't a buying sort of game. Yeah. I can't remember completing it. What I'd imagine is things don't get better after the first level. The first level doesn't look great, does it? When I was a 14-year-old, or however old, old I was when this came out, what year was this? 95. I would have welcomed this sort of humour, I think. Yeah? Again, oh, yeah. Throw bogeys. Fart on things. Fart. Yeah. It's a dark storm night at Professor Stinkman's lab where a machine has been built to save the world from pollution by transsexting. Trans is that even a word? Transsexting. Transsexting. <laughs> Transsexting. Transsexting. Trans Eccentric millionaire Snotty Ragstail. So Snotty Ragstail has taken a job at the lab to investigate safety and find out exactly where the pollution is going. It's quite hard to read that green text on that. It is. Background. I was just about to say, what go on in this anyway? What, what's happening? Look at him. <laughs> now, what you have to remember, he's a millionaire. He's not. He's a cleaner. He just, he's in disguise. They just said he's an eccentric millionaire. Oh, uh, right. Look, he's got toes missing from his shoes. Like Fagan. Like a tramp. <laughs> right, what can I do? Jump. Lovely. Yeah. I look at these little animations. His little like, cramps. La, like that. And then yeah. what can I do? I can flick bogeys. Flick bogey at that guy. That's nice. I can jump. I can... Burp. Burp. Yeah, I remember. Uh, which is uh, using your burp power. Oh uh, yeah, I remember. You can hold it down and do a mega burp. Yeah. Look at the look at oh, his, his teeth. teeth. He's he's gonna shit himself. Oh, oh you just got fucked. Oh no, no, Mr. Snail. Face, snail. No, Mr. Snail. Is that like a Mario pipe? It looks like it. I was gonna say it's gone from rags to riches, but it's gone from riches to rags. Yeah, it's gone. It's just lots of bricks. Oh. You melted like you're out at the end of Indiana Jones. Uh, oh, right. what? no, I'm not having this. There's nothing worse than a game that takes Look you at the all face. the way. Oh, there you go. End of the level, well done. I feel like, unless there's a change of scenery at some point, or bosses or anything. You think this will get it's pretty, pretty, pretty well? Yeah. Oh. The hook, the gimmick, wouldn't be enough for me to... No. Do you think a game like Boogerman would um, have its... Fans today. Let me just. I think we're trying to rush too much. Is part of the problem. That's my problem all the time with these games. It's why I. Two hits. What are the plungers then? They're just can, are they, can you use another button to like do something with them? Oh! You just ran straight into him. Yeah, it wasn't deliberate. You need to go a little bit slower. You're not good enough to go that fast. Hey, my life hey, motto, you reached the end of that stage, though. The plungers give you points, it would seem. 
Well, I'm pretty sure so that's, that's telling you there's a up. toilet up there to get one of those bonus toilet level things. Right, okay. I guess. You're quite the boogerman progress. We finally found your game. Oh, oh, okay. Maybe it doesn't regenerate. The Listen, level, why... if the next level is the same, yeah, I think we're gonna. But we are still in the same world, right? Look, see, you're in the flatulent swamps. It's probably got three stages. Three's the charm, right? Okay. Three's the charm. There won't be a flatulent swamp four. I guarantee it. Oh, big stuff. Big burp. Big burp. I think the jokey theme has already run its course. Yeah, because this is my point about Earthworm Jim, right? It's like every level. Kind of reinvents itself. Something humorous or yeah. something different. Yeah, but it does different things all the time. Yeah. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, that's game over. No, it's not. Oh, well. well, that's enough booger, man. Answer, answers on a postcard. Is there a flatulent swamps for? <laughs> yeah, we need to know. Why give us a password? <laughs> There's some quite cool getting. looking creatures on here. Like, look, look, some of these other things look great. He's pretty cool. We should name these. Like, dumb fuck. <laughs> that one. Right, are we done for? Yeah, are we done I for Booger so. Man? I think so. I was quite sad because I wanted to see what else it. Uh, what add more to what it had to offer? Had to offer. Oh my god, it's Clay Fighter. Right, Clay Fighters, what? here we go. So this is from 1993. So 1993. So this is two out. years earlier than than um, Booger Man. So it was 95, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. I wonder how close it was to like stuff like Donkey Kong Country because this is all pre. They have but one goal in all the universe: to be king of the circus. Are these pre-rendered? We class as pre-rendered or no. versus mode? Yeah, Here we go. Let's go versus mode. And listen, I'm yeah. not impressed with. Stop being such a fucking Debbie Downer. Right? Debbie Downer. You've selected Frosty. No. <laughs> no. I can't do anything. Up and up and down, you, you dumb fuck. Well, does that make sense? Well, yeah. Would you, no, 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 no. When you're picking up from a roster, would you go yeah, left or right, or roster. would you go up and down? Well, I'd go up. No, and... no. Left or right or up and down. If you, if you if were it's to make a it list, from a I'd UX point of view, from a UX point of view. <laughs> yes, but you are also looking at it, and I can see oh, yeah, the there's fucking a list. names. There's, there's a list. Yeah, I didn't realise it was. Why am I only seeing the heads? I want to see these things and they're all. They, I mean, look at the heads. I'm gonna be Tink. Look at Tink. He looks like a potato. It's tiny. What? It's called Tink. It says tiny. Oh, yeah. What's wrong with me? <laughs> you can't see a list. I can't read the word tiny. You can't see that. This is, this, is a few, this is a view into 20 years' time when we're in the same <laughs> old people's home together. Oh, it's, it's fucking press it's, left! It says up. Tink! <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait a second. I've got to be BS Goo. BS Goo. Blue Suede Goo. That's Blue the Suede name. Goo. I like him. That's amazing. Well, I thought that statue was happening. He's servicing two he men is, there. Look at him. Yeah. You know when you do that? Yeah. Can you still do... I could work too. Yeah, you can, yeah. I could work too. What stage do you want to go to? I want to go to the one masturbating. The, masturbate. the guy who's okay. jerking off the two The masturbating Colossus. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, oh. here are the combatants... I think he's supposed to... Oh my god, god, look at Tiny. He's that? so fucking ripped. Would you look like that for Who's £10 million? Pounds? <laughs> yeah. Well, Why not? Look at this guy. Oh, I did not expect there to be a lion there. Oh my god, I'm so shit. Oh, stop hugging me! <laughs> Look at his eyes. Right, can I try and work out what the fucking moves are? No, that's the answer. <laughs> Tink wins. <laughs> Tink absolutely smashed it. Twink. This isn't going as well for Tink this time. Oh! Was that my move or your move? Mine. <laughs> yeah, look at him. Yeah. Right, I'm going bonker this time. I'm going to be Icky Bod Clay. Oh, I remember that name, actually. Which one do you want to go to? Let's go with that fucking thing. <laughs> Whatever it is. Ladies and gentlemen. I tell you what, I'm quite enjoying like the characters and the yeah. animations and stuff. Yeah, yeah. It actually played a bit better than I thought it would. I it was more responsive, I think is what I mean. Stop button bashing. It's the name of the show, Brass. You are shit, aren't you? Look at that slow ass fireball. <laughs> Fuck me! <laughs> <laughs> so shit. Oh, I'm gonna be hell of it this time. I'm gonna be the blob. <laughs> oh, oh, that that? Did you Oh my god. Oh, that's cool. You turn into a boot. This is fucking garbage. 
What? Chop me off! Don't get frustrated because I'm better than you. You better have button bashing it. <laughs> just fucking have it. Bonk me on the head of the hammer. I like that guy. Look, it's a, yeah. look, look at him. He's so happy. He is. I'd like to go to the pub with him. I like that. Honestly, I'm so shit. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I mean, I've not beat you once. Is there any we haven't been yet? Taffy. Taffy and Frosty. That's Taffy is the one who I... One of the characters who I visually most remember from this game. looks like one of those things from Star Wars. He's like really like long and lanky, got like long bendy limbs. Ladies and gentlemen, here, here we go. Bad Mr. Frosty, here he comes. Big hunk of burning clay. Come here, you fucking coward. <laughs> Look at you, just crumpled Crumpy. mess. Oh, it's not going well for Mr. Frosty. <laughs> <laughs> you want one? Yeah! You want a round? I was going to bring back. Fucking come on! <laughs> Fucking come on! <laughs> oh, I so see you found that move. Yeah! <laughs> I just kept doing that. Same like, like, no, That's I so cheap. I can't believe I did that. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. I'm, I'm more embarrassed by doing the same move over and over again than I am by just losing. I enjoyed that more than I thought I would, if yeah. I'm entirely honest with you. Yeah. I went into that being like, this is going to be terrible. Yeah. And it was quite funny. I quite like some of the characters in that. Right, up on Jim. Here we are. This is, the, this is the game you buy the set for. Of course. I love it. There's, yeah. a punch, there's, a, there's a joke as well with a punchline, and it happens at the very beginning of the game, and then the punchline happens at the very end of the game. And it's with, brilliant. What, with a cow? With a cow. Yeah. It's brilliant. What's come out is the designer of all these characters, yeah. who's a very talented artist. Yeah. Don't, oh, I won't say any names, but apparently it's come out as a bit of a... Like, it's one of them where I don't meet your heroes. Right, okay. That's it's a just shame. shame. Just the quality of this game is oh, so... Yeah. Like, just in every level. I mean, it looks great, right? It still looks really good, and it still is really responsive. Yeah, so that cow, you launch it into the air. Yeah. And do you remember what happened? Oh, yeah, it comes goes? back and squashes the princess, the princess at the end of the game. Rescue, yeah. yeah. Spoilers. I mean, gameplay-wise, what do you think? I think it holds I, up I as a 2D as a platformer. It, I still think it plays really well. If I had one issue to pick with it, really, it's that you have to use your high-power weapon there once you get it. Yeah. You can't switch back and store it for later. Oh. You know, like we've talked about, we've talked about it on many, on quite a few games that we've played, where yeah. you can tell they've put everything into the first level, and then the game just sort of peters out. Do you think that about this? No. That's what oh, I'm saying. This, right. this is probably one of those games where they've literally gone, right, we've got to make every level good. It's also the epitome of games from around that time, to some degree, where, I mean, it's all a bit nonsensical, right? Yeah. Like, the levels don't necessarily, there's no consistency. Mm, there was a, There is a secret route which I missed, but it takes you right to the boss. There was a cartoon as well, wasn't there? Do you remember oh, the cartoon? Yeah, action figure in line as well. Yeah, I kind of would. I wish I'd got one of the action. They bring it out and you. There's a new cartoon. I've seen the trailer and for And there's a new game yeah. coming out. I think the bosses in this game were quite unforgiving, from what I remember they in are, general. Yeah. Oh, that was lucky. Eight percent health left. You did well there. I would have died. You have to whip that, yeah. don't you, onto the end? Yep. Go, uh, 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 uh. It's so random. It reminds me, it just make me think of things like Cophead to some degree, you know, like in terms yeah. of like just because a lot of that is quite random. Oh, yeah. In terms of its design. It's, oh, you needed that one. It gives you a boost, right? I don't know. No, that's the booster. Good. The other one's a shield. shield yeah, that's Easy. Fucking stomped him. Over to you, Brass, for stage two. Oh, my favourite. See Evil the Cat there yeah, in the background. Yeah, in the background. Earthworm awesome. It is. I'd, I'd, I'd say anybody to play it. Like, Did you ever uh, play the Mega CD version of that? No, but apparently the best that's version. The, yeah, apparently that's the... It's the, the definitive, definitive version. version yeah. It's got extra level in it. it. Yeah, I'll have to play it's got it. extra stage. Come Russ. Whip that guy. Whip him and shoot him. Is that what it was? Yeah, you have to whip him and shoot him when his briefcase goes up. That's what the fuck are you doing? Whip him. Shoot him. Earthworm Jim is one of those games I can just always go back to. Yeah, Brass, stop fucking dying, Brass! What's wrong with you? It's it's not letting up. Why are you so shit? Uh, well, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's all the time, isn't it? Yeah. 
It's this bit here is really annoying. Yeah, you're walking into every one of them. Yeah, but how are you supposed to avoid it? Do, do you want Daddy to do it for <laughs> yeah, you? Yeah, go on. What are you doing? I'm doing worse than you now. I told you, there's no level. I told you. <laughs> it doesn't stop. Don't, don't blame me. There we bloody go. Do, 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 do. I like the fact that the gun, when you fire it, yeah, you stand still. Now remember, you need to be ready. He's going to come a different direction. You've got to shoot him as he comes. Nine lives, right? Yeah, you've got to take his nine lives as well. Yeah. Not many lives left, surely. No, probably not. You did it! You fucking did it! Now you'll go and the asteroids, and then we'll... And then we'll call it a day. There he is. Oh, no. Psycho! He was kind of like the always villain in the cartoon, wasn't he? He was like always... Oh, probably whipping me. But it was the one that you interact with. Uh, it's like a Boba Fett type, right? He fucked you up, yeah. He fucked you up. He did. Oh, no, I got no him. there you go. Oh, no. Oh, oh, right, so you do have to whip him after you shoot him. Come on, you got him. Oh, there you go. Nice. Close. Cool. Right. Earthworm Jim. Safe to say that's the best one we've by, had so By far. a country mile. Incantation. Not one... Like I said, I remember when I saw a piece of artwork from it, but I don't remember it from... Not the foggiest. Oh. Okay. It's got that, start, that kind of art style that you saw in quite a lot of games. Of... We've played a few on Button Bashers that have had a very similar art style. All feels a bit going from Earthworm Jim to this. <laughs> yeah. We should maybe have done Earthworm Jim last. Look at him. He looks like he means business with that club. He's like, come on in. Oh, do you need another... Oh, you've got to have three wheat to get through there. You need to go back and find one. It's weird, because, it, I mean, visually it's alright, but I'm just... It's empty, soulless. Like yeah. Last game. It's just coming from Earthworm Jim. It's, oh. Oh. Okay, well, there's a wheat. You've got enough wheat. The man wants three wheat. you got three wheat. Through you go. Oh. Oh! I knew it was going to do that as well. Yeah. No! <laughs> Yeah. Do you want to play? I'll have a quick, I'll have a quick shot at it, just so I can have an opinion. Fucking hell. I'm not doing very bad. I'm not doing very well at these things. Right, I've only got slightly more health than you for the boss now. Well, you've got your three weeks. I don't even know if that's doing damage either. Just remember to go under him. Uh, you don't have enough time, do you? No. Fucking hell. That's hard, right? I don't think he's that... doing any damage. Do you, do you think you've got to hit him in the head? Yeah. Well, I, I don't care to find out. No, I don't really either. Right. Should we call it a day? Yeah, we'll call it a day on that one. Right. Wow. Titan. Final game. It doesn't look great from the visual. Titan is a unique blend of block breaking and maze navigation. Your goal in each stage is to use your character to hit the ball into a specific target. So 88 is the original release of this game. Yeah, it's a shame it's the last one on the cart, really. It's because they're in alphabetical order, isn't it, I think? It's one of those weird things, isn't it, where it's got like this kind of like almost album cover artwork yeah, yeah, yeah. which has nothing Just to do with the game at all okay so what is this game hot knows from the front cover it looks like it, it should looks be like a, some amazing it looks like a metal album yeah uh, it's basically breakout breakout <laughs> i'm literally having to do nothing <laughs> oh no wait you're no. doing really oh now you're gonna have to wait just move oh no, no you have to intervene a little bit but your intervening seems to be making it worse. Oh. Yes. Smash that, mate. That was easy. Come out shot. Con yeah, yeah, that's a good point, actually. <laughs> this is fun. The game where you have to do nothing. I'm here to spectate. It's like playing the lo the screensaver <laughs> on one of those old DVD players. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'd still prefer to play back Breakout. 100%. Oh. That's it, you found it, you found the sweet spot. Whoosh! Oh, I think there might be enough on that. You reckon? Right. I think I'm done. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I'm I think that's uh I think that's enough of that. Okay. So that is Evercade 4. Interplay collect Interplay, Interplay collection, collection one. one. Ports. Uh, Obviously, I thought Jim's the best on here. Let's... Well, without without a doubt, I mean yeah. that that could have its own that could just be, have its own car. I would probably have for, bought that. For how much they retail that? Like, like fifteen pounds. Fifteen qu they? quid, like one hundred percent. I would have bought it from Jim. I think we had fun playing everything. <laughs> that see that incantation was probably the one we sort of glazed over the quick. I, think... I, don't, I don't know how if that was the uh, from Jim effect because we just yeah. played it. I also think if I wasn't playing it for this video, I would probably have given it a bit more of a. I might have given it more of a chance. Yeah, more, I'd have played yeah. it for a bit longer. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. it was very run right. 
shoot a bad guy. Like, and like you say, especially after Earthworm Jim, which is just... If this is the scale of stuff on this cartridge, Earthworm Jim's like here, and everything Earth else is, is taking there. place what, in what, this. So what would you put next after that? I actually think I'd put Clay Fighter. I think I might put Clay Fighter second. I think it's the one I had the mo second most fun playing. I think I would have put Titan. <laughs> Titan second? Uh, a very, very, like, you, way you down. You could have moved. Very way down. because Simply because... Yeah. I can imagine playing that on my own okay. for a bit. Turn the volume off. <laughs> Play that. Put on one. a podcast. Yeah, yeah. Well, the thing is, do you know what the thing with Clay Fight was? It was the fact that the, the characters were fun. I enjoyed the animations you were fun. But did it play very well? No. It played better than I was expecting it to play. I think because I remember it didn't review that well when it came out. So I was right. thinking, like, now... I was thinking it was going to be... You were Street Fighter 2, right? I know, but I was thinking it was going to be a Rise of the Robots. And it wasn't it the Rise of the Robots. Robots. But still... It will get boring really quick because the claymation stuff was the stuff that was yeah. quite interesting and yeah, numerous. Yeah, yeah. Um, Booger Man, like again, it's a gimmick, some cool characters and creatures and stuff. Yeah. But how long will that be getting become boring? Yeah. The chess. I enjoyed the chess game. Too. I mean, it was just it was chess. Just chess. It was just chess. It was, you know, that's fine. Apart from being slow when the knights moved, it was as a two. So I wouldn't play that on my own, right? Yeah. So yeah. that's probably the best thing about you know some like clay fighter and battle chess, so but. I mean, we don't really need to wax lyrical about her from Jim anymore. Do no, we? we've already spoken about how much we like I it. I mean, yeah. So we are going to rank these. Yeah, Obviously, so. right now, this is just going onto an empty table. So this is number one. So this, this is, is number this one. Is this is one. currently the best and worst. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. No, no, that's very good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, hope you've enjoyed this video looking yeah. at Evercade Cartridge 4 Interplay Collection 1. Collection 2 is already out, isn't it? I believe. Yes, because yeah, we yeah, saw that having Earthworm Jim 2. I don't know what else. Has it got Clay Fighters 2? Is it Clay Fighter 2? Probably. Probably. Well? Probably. That'd be interesting. I'd be interested yeah, to see how it's comparison. progressed. Yeah, yeah. Hope you've enjoyed this video. It's got Titan 2 on it as well. <laughs> It's got to and battle chess too. All of them are sequels. <laughs> Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, leave a comment below. If you've got this one, let us know some of your favourite games on there. Yeah. I mean, obviously it's Earthworm Jim, but uh, <laughs> yeah. let us know if why it is, it's it Earthworm Jim. Yeah, if it's not, I'd so like to know why. medical health help. Yeah. Okay. I'd like to know why if it's not Earthworm Jim, why it yeah. isn't. Yeah, yeah. Um, if you've enjoyed this, please hit the like button, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel. We're going to be coming back doing more and more of these Evercard, Evercard? <laughs> Evercade cartridges. Uh, you can also head over to allmaverick.com where you can check out our other videos, blogs, podcasts. Go to twitch.tv forward slash allmaverick.live where we are streaming some of our favourite games. I was going to say 9pm Tuesdays and Thursdays, but we started branching out and adding more to the schedule. So just go and check that out. And also in the link below, there is a, in the description below, there's a link to our Discord server. So you can come there, come on the Discord server and chat with us about games and Shut films, and stuff. all that stuff. Anyway, cool. Thanks for watching, everybody. Thank you all. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.